Hey up everyone, welcome to another video. In this video, I've decided to show some at rat shooting over the last 12 months really, during lockdown. I like to feed all wildlife on my garden, namely all little songbirds. So I love to watch them going about the business. And it's nice to support them through winter months. Inadvertently, what happens though, is you attract rats. Obviously wild birds spill a lot of grain and seed on the floor. And although a lot of it's mopped up by larger birds like wood pigeons, crows, magpies, inevitably, you're going to get rats. I've got a CCTV camera set up on my back garden. And use it mainly for this purpose. As you can see. Got two rats there, one on feeder, one on edge of decking. Kit I'll be using, Ultimate Sporter, 4K Pro, and a Brian I IR torch on top. You just see another rat now, just nipping into the feeder, just gathering a bit of seed. And then disappearing into the fence. This is a big rat. And when I slow it down, it didn't look a very good shot, but when I slow footage down and zoom in a little bit, you can see pellet just hits above left eye. Or rat's right eye as we're looking at it. It bounced around for a few minutes, and then I found it. Laid on Ray's bed. A bomb at fence line. There you go, just above rat's right eyebrow. Jumps off, you just see it flicker about slowly. And it comes to rest near a pond. It is a little bit closer for you, and you'll see what I mean. This is quite a large adult rat. Watch pellet in flight in a second. Just above left eye. That was where we're looking at. They end up as a clean kill. Now these are some of the birds that I like to watch. Couple of little sparrows here. And they're soon joined by a few more. Now it is first day of spring. I think that was yesterday, UK. You can see there's a combination of male and female sparrows here. So I like to think that by feeding these, I'm encouraging more little birds. You see blackbird come along, bullied all little birds off. When you do observe these birds, obviously blackbirds are lovely birds, and they're songbird, and they make some nice calls. But they will bully littler species of birds. And you can see why are they feeding that they're throwing a lot of food on the floor. They're sifting through for all the little bits they want. The favoured choice, let's say. Now what you'll see in a second or two. When these birds disappear, who makes an appearance? Our friend, or four, the Norwegian rat. And they call them Norwegian rats. Because they came over on boats many, many years ago and they colonised UK. Just watch to the left hand side of the feeder. It's like bird knows that it's coming. And here he is. And it's only a youngster. You can see how it comes, disappears. They ain't got confidence to stay there and sit. So I always know where I'm dealing with youngsters. Round occasion. He just hung about a little bit too long. They got a pellet straight to the brain box, as illustrated in this image. That's one of the bigger ones that I'd shot previously. This is last summer. Fidgety adult rat. 
as you can see they have a lot more confidence because they hang about a lot longer and they like to favour this left hand corner maybe they can smell the comrades their little runs they seem to just grab a piece of wheat from round corner sit back up on their haunches and I like to send a pellet flying towards the brain box as you can see this is probably May or June last year they've got some potatoes growing just at the left hand side of the feeder nice shot placement straight between eyes and it's good night for that big rat you can see they come in a variety of colours some look grey some look brown I suppose it depends on how light it is again CCTV footage you can just see IR light flicking on then and this is before I built like my raised bed and it rolled down old stone embankment that used to be here before I'm not sure what these ones are they're not sparrows unless they're a different type of sparrow we can tell they're slightly different species of bird you can see rat come out to the left hand side and it just spooked that bird but it is again again another youngster this is one that my son got going i think again last summer very very fidgety he's using his p15 when i'm talking through it at this point i'm just saying wait for your opportunity you have to be quick and take your shot when you can so i've got him over in his crosshair where he thinks rat's going to come out here it is and that was a lovely shot from cohen really proud of him now if you don't shoot the adults and the young when you see them you're going to with lots and lots of baby rats and as soon as you get a few you're going to get a lot more so it's always best to keep on top of them and sort them out as quick as you can and look who's back again piece of seed and off he goes now when the youngsters sometimes as i mentioned before they won't come to the front of the feeder and they stay between lats in fence they think they're safe but they're not now behind my fence is a big mound of earth full of bricks so even if pellet did pass through it's going to get stuck in that mound of earth now team these two walk in between lats i'm just getting ready to get lined up on this one and the second one pops out to right and it sort of distracts me for a second or two and i waste my opportunity A little bit later, an adult rat comes out. Again, very fidgety. Putting crosshairs on it, moving slightly, making adjustments. On its haunches. Let pellet go. Another big brute. Lovely shot. Them youngsters are still around, but I will catch up with them. Now, this was just the other day. I was just in cabin. I was fettling the rifle actually, cleaning it and stuff. I noticed a rat. Then there were two. So I'm leaning out of cabin wind in here. That's why it's a little bit shaky. But I didn't waste my opportunity. And this is one of them youngsters. Thankfully, it's not going to reach a ripe old age. I just saw it then to the right side of another one. This is other youngster. Just waiting. I 
And there you go. Take that one down. Power a side on shot. And if you put your shot between eye and ear, it's going to be lights out for any rat. It is. A little bit more zoomed in for you. Blends in nicely to that grey fence. Very difficult to see, so I'm just trying to pick out his head properly here. So I'll probably something to eat. And that's another nice dispatch. So that's them two youngsters took care of. And a couple of adults this week as well. So here's another one. Same place. Def definitely a different rat. You're watching slow motion. It's not the same one as before. And you can see that struck home lovely. See difference in colour again? I have to mention it again. Sometimes they're browner, sometimes they're greyer. That one of the youngster. That were recent as well. Now I've seen another youngster here. There's a little bird on feeder just at the left hand side. I know a rat's gonna come out. As soon as the bird flies off, I have to be quick. And you can't get any quicker than that. Now waiting already. And as soon as I saw it, gently squats trigger and release my shot. Now this video is a little bit different. I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know in the comment section. As always, thank you for your support. I'll see you soon in another installment.